what's going on guys cdc arts here back with a brand new video and i just got just my camera or not the camera my light a little bit but today we're going to be doing an art tutorial of all my art it's a decent stack um then reach back over here i got a notebook but this one says Carson Art, not CTC, because my first name is Carson. Um, I was going to be doing that until I found this really awesome drawing that I did a long time ago. And then, because my old art channel used to be CTC Arts, and I decided to bring it back and decided to put that as my logo. But it might not be that interesting to you guys, because you probably saw it as my logo. But here we go. We have like a gaming guy has a few tattoos um there's like a harry potter one so don't want to bend it harry potter like someone holding the wand just gotta put in my art pouch right there and then right there um my favorite youtube channel like my favorite vlog channel was a royalty family i drew this on the day that they hit one million subscribers so shout out to the royalty family and i drew it on a mountain because they live in hollywood and there's a big mountain with the hollywood sign on it so i just didn't add in the hollywood sign then here is a, the only video that i did on my ctc draws channel um or ctc art channel it's the raven from Teen Times Ago, and here is the logo. It's probably one of my best drawings, um, but I bent it right there. As you, if you guys can't see, I'm sorry, but here's another one of my drawings. Um, it's I have to put it up close right there. I did it on bad paper. So that's why it's wobbling around and everything. I'm also going to show you a painting that I did. Um, here's the one that I did in my first video. It's just the guy and then like this cool sun thing in the background. Um, I decided to do that because I just thought it looked cool. And my one of my favorite art artists is Quick Draw 35 He usually does stuff like that and... Also, let's go on to the next thing. Me and my friend Michael, um, we had to do an economic thing, or like, yeah, like economic. We had to make our own business and sell stuff for, with fake money, and people could come over and buy it. So they took like an hour and a half out of the school day just to do that. So we made lots of drawing, and I bought most of the drawings because no, not many people bought the drawings from the thing. So I just used most of my money to buy that, the, most of the fake money to buy it. And there's like Nico. Um, we tried to make a comic called Nico and the Niners. So that's Nico. And then this was just like kind of random. Um, I was gonna. I used to like do like the six minute thing, and then I stopped. Um, it's gonna be worse and worse at art. And I decided to come back and do more art because I really started enjoying it again. And then here, it's not that good, but here's like kind of my spider sona. Um, I decided to do it after I saw ZHC do it. So I was like, what if I make my spider sona? I was like, and then I looked at it afterwards. I was like, I'm just going to stop. It, It's bad. It's really bad. And here, um, that's my friend. He drew something like this, and I decided, he told me, why don't you redraw it? Of what I did and I was like um he said like go draw it in your art form so I did cuz his guy had like a purple eye like that thing over its face and then like had a smirk and then he had D.I.E. on his shirt like with dots I forget what it stands for and then he had green skin like a zombie and rip paint and I just added rip pants for effect so that's like that was an easy drawing, but here's another picture of Nico. It's not the greatest. It's like in color. Like, okay. There we go. And there's lightning right there, and there's someone falling from the sky. I forget who that was. 
But let's move on to the next drawing. And that's really bad. <laughs> Guys, it's really bad. That's really bad. I'm just going to shoot it down in my trash can right there. And then there's Niner. The one that was nine Niners. Whoops, knocked on my camera a little. Um, but there's Niner one. Um, and then there's something on the back too. It's a double whammy. On the guy in his telescope. Um, that says stay chill. And then he's like not chill, like a meteor shower is happening. I don't know what I was doing right there. But here we go into the next drawing. Here is Nico again, the same drawing. Um, I think all, I think the best one that we did, like it was the first one, it was like a really good drawing that Michael did, and that was the only one that we sold out of the Nico stuff, I think. But that's just hold on, I forgot to show this. It says Team Life because I was gonna put Thug Life, but I was like, wait, aren't thugs bad sometimes? So I just decided not to put thugs. So I'm just gonna put that back in there. And here we go, I just decided to draw brands. There's Skecher, there's Old Navy, Active, there's Adidas, Nike, Under Armour. That one, I don't think was as good as I predicted it would be. But now we're gonna go on to the next one. Get his name, it was like Bat Boy or something. And then, there's a head on the back for some reason. We're gonna go on to the next art. And then here is like like a bunny, a guy um, lassoing the sun. And then like they're on a mountain, there's the clouds or something. And the guy's trying to hang on, there's a boomerang coming up. Or like a fishing hook. And yeah, that guy. I don't know what I was doing. I don't think I was as good as art back then as I am now. Here's another Niner from Nico and the Niners. Um, we stopped because, like, the comic was really hard to make because there's so many Niners. We need to include them in everyone. So here's Niner number nine. He's a drum player. Um, art is just, like, one of my hobbies. I really like art. And he was actually my first Sonic the first time I ever tried to make Sonic, I think it was a, it's a really good turnout. And then I just messed up. And then here's like a drawing that I used a light tracer on at my art. Um, you can grab like a picture of art and then just light trace it. So that's one of them I did. I um, and me and my friend used to make music on a channel called Bros and Beats. Um, so I made our logo right there. It's pretty colorful and I liked it so much. Like, Caden liked it too. Um, we stopped Bros and Beats because the songs were hard to make and he wanted to make two a week. I was like, no, we can't do that. And, he, and then he's like, then we're not doing this anymore. And then there's my friend's drawing. I forget, it's like a Sonic character. And then, here's another one. Um, these are all the ones that I bought from the art stand. Um, and there's another one. He's a really good drawer when it comes to, like, those characters, you know? Um, can that fit back in? Yes, it can. There we go. And then, here's another Sonic right there. That's his other Sonic that he drew. That's like jumping up in the air. And then I think that thing is like looking so bright. It looks like I got makeup on. I'm not lying. But um, yeah. There we go. I put 50 subs right there because on my vlogging channel I have 50 subscribers. This one says Carson's Art Book. 
Um, and then right there it says 2020. And then it says um, subscribe to Galaxy Gaming, which is my gaming channel. We, I run the gaming squad. And then here we go. Um, this was my first drawing in this book. The guy on Gucci, wearing Gucci. I think I did pretty good on the Gucci symbol. He has money in his hand and is gone like peace. I like the way I drew that. Um, next drawing. Here's like a teddy bear. I didn't like that drawing that much, so I'm just gonna skip real quick. Um, and then dope. That drip effect. I looked up. I saw a picture of it online. I was like, I'm gonna try to do that. Turned out pretty nice. That's my first drip effect that I've ever did, and I really thought it was good. And then, my, probably my best drawing this year. Oops, I keep on knocking down the camera. That's a little too far. Sorry, guys. But there is Baby Groot. Look how cute he looks, guys. And then he's like in the pot growing. And then he has like his little arms and has the big eyes and kind of looks like regular group. group. And then here is one, another one of our old comic characters. I knew we used to draw like a lot of comics. Um, there's Astro. This is probably my favorite comic that we've ever done. Um, he has like dots, like dotted tattoos on his neck. Um, a star with an A in it on his shirt. Um shoulder blades um, a tattoo over his nose and like these weird pieces of hair um and then he has like a robot machine on his arm and yeah two more things and that's gonna wrap it up for the video i know you guys are probably sad but we're gonna go rip this off batman batman symbol i didn't really like it that much i feel like it was like off a little bit so put that back up, and this is the one that I drew, or painted a few days ago. It's a upside down sloth, because you guys might not be able to see it, but he's hanging on a branch right here, and then there's leaves all around him. Um, my mom went, drew the leaves and the blue around it, which is like a really good, or really cool, which I, I that's probably my favorite part. And then like the cool sloth, you can see his toenails or whatever you call them on sloths, toenails hanging on off the branch. And yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed, um, go ahead and smash that like button, turn it blue. And you see that red subscribe button? It needs to be gray or else this sloth's going to fall from the tree. You guys don't want that sloth to fall from the tree, right? So go ahead and make that subscribe button gray and turn on those post notifications so he doesn't die when he falls from the tree. And that's going to be in the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash that like button. I already went over that. And see you guys in the next video.